surprised me, Joseph. When Navera signed in July, I asked my dad when Yonder wasn't signed yet, and he still said there was plenty of time. Then I asked him in August when Yonder wasn't signed yet, and he still said there was plenty of time. So then I asked him in September when school started, when Yonder wasn't signed yet, and he still said there was plenty of time. When, and then I asked, when hockey camps opened, I asked my dad when Nylander wasn't signed yet, and he still said he, there was a lot of time, but it shouldn't be it shouldn't be long. And then he said after the last exhibition game, I asked my dad when Nylander wasn't signed yet, and he said it what would happen. It would be done before the Canadians play the Leafs in the season opener that happened a couple days ago. Then. After they beat the Hayden Montreal Canadiens in overtime, I asked him, and he said he had no clue. That he thought the deal would be done by now. And now I'm worried. And then yesterday I hear about Michael Michael Pekka sitting out a year in, in Buffalo, and now I'm very worried. And I'm 11 years old. I should not worry. So, Mr. Nylander, please sign with the Toronto, re-sign with the Toronto Maple Leafs. There's three... Points. A, Matt, Mr. Matthews needs his right winger to score goals and give him assists. I picked you in my hockey pool, and I'm not trying to take Dubis's job, but these are the numbers that Dubis or I would give you. It would be six years for $37.5 million, or eight years for $54 million. Mr. Nylander, please talk to your agent and tell him to talk to Mr. Dubis. Mr. Dubis... Please get on the phone and work out a deal with him. I will always negotiate with my dad, and somehow we would end up in the middle. But if we didn't talk, we would be mad at each other, and both of us would lose. Please talk and get the deal done. We love you, Mr. Nylander. We've had enough losing Toronto, and now it's time to help us bring a winner. Please get the deal done.